All right, so it's been a little bit since I did the uh, review on my King Quad. Uh, when I had did the review, it was still on stock wheels and tires. I had just put the high lifter two inch lift kit on and some spacers on the rear just to give me a little bit more stability. Um, other than that, you know, maybe some LED lights, that was it. Um, pretty much a stock machine. Now I haven't done too, too much to it, but a little bit more than, uh, than it was. And it's definitely a lot better. And I've definitely noticed an increase in performance. So uh, let's check it out, see what we got. All right, so here's my King Quad 500. Now, noticeably, first off, you'll notice I got wheels and tires. So that being said, I got 14 inch quad boss wheels. They're uh, 14 by sevens, if I'm not mistaken. And then I went ahead and got the 27 by nine by 14 STI black diamond tires. Now, so far, so good, have no complaints. I went with a square setup all around, so I got 27 by nines all the way around. Um, a lot of people go wider in the rear. I really wasn't so much concerned with having more contact. I wanted more bite. So that's why I just decided to go ahead with a square setup. Um, still got the Kimpex front and rear bumpers. I, I love them. I don't know why anybody would pay more for like the other brands. I mean, obviously, if you got the money, great, go ahead. But I mean, for what most people are using their machine for, I don't really see the need in going out and spending money on those more expensive front bumpers. Um, honestly, for me, it's just so my plastics don't break and don't mess up my actual four wheeler and I can replace a, you know, $120, $150 bumper pretty easily myself. Still got the KFI winch. I have used it a lot here lately. Uh, my girl, she's got a two wheel drive, uh, a quad and yeah, I've been pulling her out like crazy. So yeah, definitely speak, uh, speak good things on the KFI winch. So if you're hesitant on getting one, I wouldn't be. Like I said, still got the high lifter, uh, two inch lift kit on this thing. Uh, went ahead and got some, I think they're called Speed Demon grips. I just like the little skulls. They were pretty cool. So, yeah. Um, other than that, I got the Big Gun Evo U exhaust. I did put an install video up, and I did put an initial review of it. Um, it's I haven't put two ten million miles on it. Maybe about 50 miles since I installed it. And uh, still badass, still sounds good. Uh, one thing I didn't hit on my install video, on your stock exhaust, there is a little, uh, I guess, a, almost like a, I don't want to say a gasket, but there's a little insert on your stock exhaust tube. Make sure you take that insert out and put it into the big gun, otherwise you'll have some play going into your header pipe. Um, here's what the uh, two-inch lift looks like back here. But uh, yeah, so this thing rides so much better. Um, when I had put the spacers on the stock wheels and tires, I wasn't initially gonna run them when I put wheels and tires on this thing. However, it was feeling a little tippy, so I just went ahead and put the uh, put the spacers back in. You see them there. They're the high lifter spacers, built aluminum, uh, super nice piece, so I'm not really worried about them. Uh, yeah. So, if uh, you were wondering about the King Quads, a lot of people, you know, it's all about the Hondas, it's all about the Polaris or the Can-Ams, you know. These are some of the better riding machines. Now, don't get me wrong, in a straight line, a Can-Am is gonna smoke me all day. Like, it's, you know, n like nobody's business. But I mean, as far as durability, riding all day long through the trails, mud, whatever, I mean, I don't think you could beat the, the value and the performance of the King Quad. I mean, yes, I'd love to have a Can-Am, but uh, you know, different machines for different things. So, yeah, don't ever, uh, don't ever feel hesitant thinking the King Quad's not a, uh, not a good bike to have. Yep. So there she is. I also deed badged it just because uh, I don't like the big four by four King Quad logos everywhere. I don't know. But yeah, let me know what you think. Drop down in the comments. Make sure you uh, like and subscribe. Follow along for more.